Yes guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are here with a tour of a hardcore Minecraft world after one week of playing. As you can see, it's been busy. We've been with some friends. We've been been loving it. Uh, playing some Minecraft, you know, as you do for a week now. I've been streaming over on Twitch, Pro Gaming YT. Uh, let's get straight into this. So when I first came here, I saw I saw these views of the of the water. And I was like, wow, that's brilliant. That is brilliant. But now I've added a football pitch. It looks even better. I haven't finished the stadium yet. Um, it's nearly done. But yeah, this is my house. So <coughs> got an armor stand there, an armor stand there for some. Cheeky armor. I have Gav chainmail leggings somewhere. I don't know where, but somewhere in this world. Um, this is my bed up here. I uh, got the furnaces there. And when you when you wake up, the cool thing is go straight down the ladder. Then you're ready to go. Chest is well, these chests are random. Haven't really done much in my house um, apart from sleep. So as you can see here, we got brewing stands two. For me, make our little potions eventually. Chest, two blast furnaces, just at the side there. We have our storage. This is our storage area. This was the first thing I built because <coughs> I had so much wood. Because this was like a forest on here. Uh, I obviously chopped it down. Um, so I got my munch, which is wool. Embrace my Welsh heritage. Uh, food. This is true information. Railway wood. Wars. See how rich we are in this chest pretty pretty good with gold but obviously other people in this world will have them stuff on them um, I'll travel to the nether real quick just to show you how the nether is it's obviously it's quite good as we're right above a fortress which is class um, not much in this chest but oh crap okay uh, well I sadly won't be able to show you <coughs> the nether um, but yeah, as you can imagine what a fortress is like, there's one right below and there's a lot of things that kill you when you leave that. <laughs> um, these are our first farms. Obviously bamboo foot wasn't there first, but we got bamboo now. We had sugar cane and we had wheat. Um, we have the enchantment room table. I mean, I had loads of books like all in here until I remembered that it has to be a pattern to get the max level and not all yammed together. This was the sex shack, uh, but it had three beds, but my mate thought it was funny to take every single bed and whack it over there, um, so that's why there's no beds there. This is the automatic wheat farm, if you've never seen one before, basically, you pull this lever, down on water comes, and then down there you get your seeds and you get your wheat, and then you pick them up and you plant everything again, let it grow, then it comes back and you just repeat. It's quite easy. Uh, this is our cave down here. Oh, when we first came in, it's what we used to start it off as our cave. Just put a little stairway there. Nothing too spectacular. And then I brought a big bridge over it. And then I put a fence around it. So we didn't fall in and die. Over here, we got a potato farm with no potatoes on the go at the moment. Which is quite sad, but... <coughs> we do have a cow farm, which is in full force. Uh, just a few cows over here, and a couple of pigs. One's escaped. There used to be chickens in there, I think. Um, buy this great wool. We've got bells. Uh, I've got this tower to show you what it's like. This is the little viewing point that was built. <coughs> uh, quite a nice view. You got great views over there, and. Uh, I mean, I guess you can see the see the world kind of. You can't really because of the, the gap there, but <coughs> that's that's the world so far. I mean, want to go to sleep real quick. Uh, sleeping in front of the uh, or Herm's house now. Herm's house. I haven't read a sign yet, so I'm gonna go read the sign. Herm's house is very unique. Uh, good build, probably quite quite good build. This bit of water is for me to jump and not die because PP too big. Assumed by PP, he means something like plank platform to jump off of into the water. Herm's house, do not enter, please. It's nice to know he's got his manners, but we're going to enter it anyway. Uh, so up we go into the main bit. He's got a crafting table. He's got furnaces. 
He's got a chest. Do we look in his chest? Nah, that's mean. That's mean. He's got a bed. Oh, and he's got some. Not sure what that is. I wouldn't know anyway. Um, he's got a blue bed. Not sure what that's for. Uh, he's got this. I think it means jump off this. I'm not sure you got to get onto that, but if you're a hardcore park park man like me, you can get on that. And yeah, this is the upstairs, the top of the mountain, uh, which was where we built first, then slowly migrated down into or onto the floor which a lovely stairway down to the football stadium brilliant view of that but I built my sheep farm down here as it started up there we got loads of sheep obviously I had to travel 12,000 blocks away to get the wool and then 12,000 blocks back to get no the cactus for the pitch because there's no cactus or no desert for miles which is stupid and I cried if you watch me on stream not proper tears but obviously but we have the automatic elevator this is probably this is quite cool I guess this one you don't take damage or like lose hearts or anything from drowning obviously only when you hit the bottom if you don't crouch and the reason there used to be a waterfall there but the reason this going down here started is the fishing hut we got some fishing to do here as I'm the only one that fishes but Got my little unbreaking mending rod. Don't have luck with the seat. Okay, yep. Don't have luck with the seat yet. Need that. But we got a food chest, random chest, armor, nothing, books, nothing again. <coughs> um, I'll come over to the stadium. It's still a work in progress, as you can see by my inventory. Uh, there's just a little bit of deep slate, polished deep slate. Uh, iron doors will be there, so the mobs can't get in. But yeah, it's it's cheeky, it's cheeky. Got got the away end over there. <coughs> a little bit small, but it is still pretty long to make. And um, longer. And the last thing in this world. Can you guess whether I'm going up or downstairs? This is hella spooky. The stairs all the way down to minus something, 50 odd. You can't really tell if you're going up or down. It looks the exact same. Apart from the torches kind of tell you, but it's really trippy. And this is our strip mine, so this is why we don't use a cave much anymore. I don't even do it at all, really. We have strip mines for days. And in the chest is a lot of deep slate redstone deep slate not much and not much but yeah that's the world so far one week in and I'll probably update you in three weeks time when it's a month a month on minecraft hardcore goodbye